I'm bored and a little bit sad, so let's do a quick tour of my antique book collection. First we have this book, which title, I don't know how to pronounce, I Ideala, I Ideala by Sarah Grand. Um, I have no idea how old this one is. Normally there's some sort of uh, copyright information, but I couldn't find any in here. The original, the actual book was first published in 1893, but I doubt this one is that old. Then we have this copy of the Yale Shakespeare, the copy of Romeo and Juliet, which um, was originally published in 1917, but this is the seventh printing of the uh, second edition, so it is from December 1941. And the cool thing about this one is it has handwritten notes in it um, from someone. It's got some school notes in there, which I think is really neat. Then we have this uh, copy of Milton's Poems, which includes a variety of works by Mil John Milton, who was writing in the 1600s, but this is definitely not that old. Um, it does not have a date of how old it is or when this particular edition was copyright, but I just think the spine is lovely and the cover is lovely. Then we have this book, which is a volume from the Memoirs of the Courts of Europe, and it's uh, mem er, a memoir of... Napoleon's wife, I believe, Empress Josephine. Um, and I can't remember what the, the copyright date, here we go. Copyright date on this one is 1910, it looks like. It's just another really neat one. And then there's this one, which is an English dictionary from 1942, which doesn't have very much marking on it, apart from the lovely flower illustration on the outside. And then on the inside, there are also illustrations. Lovely. Look at all of those chickens. Then there's this copy of some collected Shakespeare works. Look at that spine. Beautiful. Uh, the latest copyright date I could find on this was uh, 1882. I'll be careful with this one because it is kind of falling apart. Um, I don't know if it's actually from 1882. We've got a name signed in there. Um, there's pages falling out, but there's also uh, someone had put a handwritten note in there as well. Um, yeah, so I'm not sure exactly how old this one is, but the latest copyright date I could find is 1882. And we have this... Um, copy of Jane Eyre from 1937. You can kind of see the very nice uh, embossing on there. You can kind of tell it's from 1937 uh, by the style of the one illustration in here. She looks kind of like Snow White. I have some more, but I just didn't have time to show them all in this video, so let me know if you'd like a part two, and uh, yeah, I can show you some more of my antique books.